Today I'll explain what is a pip. I'll show you how to calculate the pip value. You will understand how position size affects the pip value. So Aussie is trading against the US dollar at 76.50. Have you noticed? Four decimal places. First, second, third, fourth. The fourth decimal place is a pip. Some brokers actually quote currencies on five decimal places, so you can actually make better decisions. The fifth decimal place is a pipet. This is how it would look for dollar yen. 120.73. First and second, so the second one is a pip. Third one is a pipet. Easy to remember is if you see five decimal places, the fifth one is a pipet. Fourth one is a pip. If you see three decimal places, third one is a pipet. Second one is a pip. So ten pipets is a one pip. If Aussie is trading against the US dollar at 7650 and you want to trade one lot, which is 100,000 units of the base currency, so what would be your contract value? Well, now we know. Your exposure times the exchange rate would give you your contract value. Pay attention, 76,500. What if the Aussie moves from 76,500 to 76,550? This is a move of 5 pips or 50 pips. Why? Fourth decimal place, from 0 to 5. So, how this would affect our contract value? So, Aussie is trading now at 76,550. Same lot, 100,000 units. Your exposure, times the exchange rate will give you now a contract value of 76,550. Have you noticed? The move from 76,500 to 76,550 is actually 5 pips. So the contract value has changed from 76,500 to 76,550, which is a difference of 50 US dollars. So 50 US dollars difference, 5 pip move. 1 pip is 10 US dollars if you're trading one lot. If you were to trade smaller than that, let's say one mini lot, the same pip would be worth less, one dollar. If you were to decide to trade the smallest trade size, one micro lot, the same pip would be worth 10 US cents. This is actually the way how you can dial up or dial down the risk that you're taking in a market. It has nothing to do with leverage. To summarize, pip actually represents the price increment. Pip value is always in a quote currency, which is the second currency in the currency quotation. Value of a pip is determined by a position size, so pay good attention to position size that you are taking in